Today, I'm going to show you how to make authentic horror film blood. This particular recipe was very popular in the 60s and became known in the trade as Kensington Gore. <laughs> Let's get started. First things first, take two cups of golden syrup. Oh, look at that. Absolutely delicious. I like this particular brand because you can store the blood in the tin afterwards. Perfect for those special occasions. Next, what you'll need is one cup of reasonably warm water. I like to think of it as the perfect temperature for a baby's bath. Just right. Now, whisk briskly together. <laughs> quite difficult. Now, usually I would wear an apron for this because you may get a few splashes. Hopefully I won't today. Doesn't that look delicious? Next, now this is a very important ingredient. 10 teaspoons of very, very red food colouring. Careful. In it goes. Delicious. Hmm, smells interesting. Now, to make it nice and thick and sticky, like real blood, what you'll need to add is 10 tablespoons of corn flour, as I have here prepared. In it goes. Now, to make it look like real, authentic blood, you have to make sure the colour is a little bit darker. So to do this, what we add is just a few drops of blue, and it goes, <laughs> lovely, and a few drops of yellow. Almost done, but not quite perfect. What we add now, just for taste, a little dash of peppermint essence. And there we have it. Let's have a taste. Mmm, delicious. 